What is going on everybody? Welcome back to a brand new video and today this is a pretty special video. Um, I don't know how long this is going to be but as you guys can see from the title and thumbnail I'm going to be showing you guys my whole entire sneaker collection. Um, I did the same thing last year around this time I believe it was like January 4th or 5th I dropped a collection video for a, a last year. Um, and you know this is something that I kind of want to do every year because you know things change man my shoes that I have now I obviously didn't have them last year um, there is a couple stuff that I still have but there's a lot of stuff that I let go let go of and you know that's just how it is um, things come and go there's shoes that I keep there's shoes that I don't keep there's shoes that I sell get rid of to get some some new heat and that's just that's 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 the sneaker game. Yeah, I don't want to talk too much because, like I said, I don't know how this, how long this video is gonna be. Um, so uh, we're just gonna get started. I have the sneakers. I took I had to take all the sneakers out the box, so now they're all over here behind me. Um, I guess we'll just start with the Jordans, and then uh, I don't know. I guess we'll do Jordan ones the Nikes and uh, the hype stuff so let's just get started so for the first sneaker in the collection we're gonna start off with something simple something iconic the Jordan 1 bands um, I had these last year I had a I'm pretty sure I had these last year or I got them last year I don't remember there's like so many shoes that I got but um, yeah, Jordan 1 Bands, classic colorway, classic shoe, Jordan 1's, you can't go wrong. Black, red, white midsole, beautiful shoe. You can wear these, beat them up, and they still look fresh. Um, I've obviously worn th this pair. But um, yeah, Band 1's. I wouldn't mind doubling up on this shoe, just to keep one on nice and beat these up. Um, but yeah. Uh, these do have glitter on them. I don't know if you guys heard. If you keep the your Jordan ones in a box, these I don't know the material or something um, starts to come out of the leather or the minerals or something like that. But yeah, it's starting to get shiny. I gotta clean these bad boys up. But yeah, first shoe in the collection, Jordan One Bands. Next shoe, I don't know what to grab. Um, I guess I'll grab these. This is a, a recent pickup. Um, I did make a video on these, the Spider-Man Jordan 1, Spider-Verse Jordan 1s, whatever you guys want to call these. These things are dope. Um, yeah, I did do a video on these. Like, um, If you guys didn't see that video, I actually camped out for this pair of shoes at a local sneaker shop. And yeah, I managed to grab them for retail, which is always nice and bro. Prices are on this shoe right now. It's like 400 so glad to get mine for a retail it's a dope shoe uh, just you know at the bottom icy bottom I'm not a big fan of that but bro leather on this shoe is nice and just the colorway Chicago colorway with that 3m hit beautiful shoe in my opinion now I do have another pair of Jordan ones but we're gonna save that for for later because you'll see why so moving on um, we have the Jordan 4 white cement beautiful shoe this is my favorite shoe of all time hands down then I gear in the back with that cement print this the shoe is just so beautiful I've obviously I've worn them um, and I definitely need to get a second pair beat these up and just keep another pair on nice like bro this shoe is just beautiful and I'm pretty sure I had this shoe last year and you know they're still in the collection so yeah Jordan 4 white cements I'm just looking around trying to see what to show you guys next because I want to show you these but I feel like I should save these for last um, I mean BAM Travis Scott Air Force Travis Scott Air Force Travis Scott 4's um, bro this shoe right here this is my favorite shoe of 2018, hands down. Um, 
actually I love this sh I love this shoe so much that I actually had to go double up on these um, this shoe Travis Scott is killing it last year he killed it you know obviously he dropped Astro World I actually went to his concert when he came down here to Philly actually wore these to the concert and bro the shoe this shoe is just beautiful those Jordan ones are dropping this year I definitely need to get at least two or three pairs and bro I can't wait for those Jordan ones to drop but yeah Jordan 4 Travis Scott's one of the best shoes of 2018 in my opinion yeah these are in the collection and they're just going to be staying in the collection bro these shoes are just fire beautiful shoe next up we have a pair of the acronym prestos uh, this is the black gray colorway um, this shoe is just my go-to shoe if I have to go somewhere real quick I just put these on um, they're just comfortable and they're just easy to wear you know this is an all black white gray shoe you can wear these with anything um, but yeah acronym prestos comfortable shoe definitely recommend it um, and yeah it's just my go-to shoe in the collection next up we have what else what should I show you guys I don't know if I go if I showed you guys these but LeBron 11 what the I'm, I don't even remember if I made a video on these but these are the LeBron 11 what the obviously the colorway just screams what the fuck is that this is a dope shoe in my opinion um, obviously it's crazy crazy colors on these it's not for everybody but me I like I like them and the thing is with this pair is that these are actually samples uh, I don't know if you guys can see that you guys probably can't see that where's the tag the tags right there this is a promo sample so um yeah these are the only samples I have in a collection mm, yeah LeBron 11 what the samples dope shoe definitely happy have these in a collection Jordan 11's Jordan 11 Concords. Um, I did manage to grab a pair off a of, off of the Nike sneakers app early when they did that surprise drop. I sold those because you know people were willing to pay over retail to get them early, but then when they officially dropped, I believe it was like December 9th or something like that. Um, I grabbed another pair, which are these this pair right here, and yeah. Dead stock Concords 45 on the back. I wish this was stitched. This is screen printed. This is gonna come off eventually, but it's whatever. Yeah, Concords classic shoe, classic colorway. Definitely happy to have these in a collection. And since I'm showing you guys the Concords, I also have a pair of the Space Jam 11s. Uh, I def I worn these. Um, but yeah, Space Jam. Now this 45 is actually stitched in on the back, so this shit is not going to come off. I don't know why then it's stitched in the 45 on the Concords, but um, yeah, this one's stitched in on the back. Space Jams, worn these a couple times. Just a nice looking shoe, classic shoe. Next up, we have. Oh, the Fresh Prince Great Fives. Um, I actually did a video on this shoe of putting laces on this shoe. And ever since then, I never went back to do the other shoe. As you guys can see, this one is still laceless, but this one has the laces. I got to go back and do surgery on this pair right here. Nike Air on the back, on the booty, dope shoe, classic shoe, classic colorway, beautiful shoe, yeah, uh, Fresh Prince Fives in the collection. Next up we have 
the Travis Scott Air Force Ones, you're probably looking at these like, why the hell are they purple? Well, if you guys didn't see my video, um, I actually dip dyed these purple. So this pair was the sale colorway. And yeah, I was just like, fuck it, you know. I'm gonna dip dye these Travis Scott Air Forces. And this is how they came out. They look so nice. I'm glad I dip dyed mine. And I'm glad it went well. Um, but yeah, custom Travis Scott Air Force Ones. Purple, one of one in the world. Dope shoe. All right, next up, we have, I believe this shoe was the last shoe I purchased. Uh, like this year so far, I haven't purchased anything yet. Um, you know, there hasn't been really anything that I wanted that's been coming out, except for those um, Air, Off-White Air Max 90s that are dropping later on this month i'm definitely gonna grab try to grab those for retail but yeah i believe this is the last shoe i purchased in 2018 which is the Kyrie 5 concepts um yeah Kyrie 5 i'm a huge fan of this model i like how this model is not as bulky as the last um Kyrie 4s i felt like the Kyrie 4s the sole was just so like huge on them but Kyrie 5 it's, it's a beautiful looking shoe. Definitely dig the shoe. And this was the Concepts Concepts uh, collab. Very dope shoe. Very dope colorway. Very dope collab. Concepts killed it. This is a very nice looking shoe. Purple bottoms. Look at that. Lean bottoms. Like, and they're shiny. Like, bruh. Very, very dope shoe. Happy to add these collect to the collection. I actually grabbed these for retail on the Nike sneakers app. So yeah, concept curry Kyrie fives. Alright, so now we're gonna start getting into the heat. Um I have a little bit of heat, not that much, but um yeah, we're gonna start it off with these right here. We have the Nike S S B lobsters, purple lobsters. I had to grab these. I didn't manage to grab these for retail, unfortunately. And this was one of those shoes that I really wanted. I had to pay a resale, but bruh, these are dope, in my opinion. Definitely top shoes that I grabbed last year. Purple lobsters, bruh. Blue laces. The inside is like a, a picnic cloth. And bruh. I definitely need to grab those green lobsters which, which actually dropped and yeah unfortunately got to pay resale but definitely going to be ending up getting those this year for sure but yeah purple lobsters I didn't make a video on these but yeah have these in the collection um, this is like the only adidas shoe that I have in the collection and like the rest are like Jordans and Nikes but this is the only Adidas shoes that I have in the collection, which is the Wave Runners, the Yeezy 700 Wave Runners. This shoe is just dope. I love the colorway, I love how it looks, and it's just comfortable. It has boost. I've worn these so many times, and every time I wear them, somebody gives me a compliment or they're like, Where did I get them? And bro, this shoe is just fire, in my opinion. Now, starting off with that fire. We have, or I have, a pair of Cause 4, the black colorway. I think I grabbed these last year and I made a video, I'm not really sure, but bro, Cause 4, this is one of those shoes that I never thought I would have in the collection, and I actually grabbed these for a steal. Um, I haven't worn them, but I probably will. Um, in a couple weeks because there's actually going to be a sneaker show a sneaker convention out here in Philly and I'm definitely going to be going to the sneaker convention this is called soul exchange I believe um, I'm gonna be going I'll probably make a video of 
me go and see what kind of what they have if I can pick up it pick up anything there um, but yeah might wear those there calls for black colorway very very nice looking shoe quality is a1 and bruh I, it's just crazy I got these in the collection beautiful beautiful shoe next up one of my favorite this is top three pickups of 2018 which is the off-white all hollows eve blazer i actually managed to grab these for retail i'm not i don't even know if i made a video on this um yeah i don't even remember but i managed to grab these for retail on the Nike sneakers app when they dropped, I believe it was a draw, and I got I got picked. And bro, this is one of the this is when I saw first saw this colorway, I was like, bro, I need those shoes. I would pay a resale for these, but luckily I managed to grab them for retail. And these shoes are just beautiful. One of the shoes is with um, orange laces, and obviously the other one is that teal laces. Bro, I haven't worn these. But um, yeah, I, I will eventually, but beautiful shoe. Definitely one of the top three pickups of 2018. Just, these are just beautiful. Beautiful shoe, off-white, Virgil, killed it. Next up, I have the Sean Weatherspoon, Watherspoon. I'm sorry if I'm mispronouncing his last name, but the Sean Air Max 97 ones. Wore these a couple of times, but I actually want to grab another pair just so I can beat one up and have one on ice um, because apparently he's dropping a new one this year. I'm not really sure if that's 100% confirmed, but if it is, then prices on these right here, the OG colorway, are going to go up. So I definitely want to grab a second pair before prices are over a K. But yeah, um, Sean Watherspoon. 97 one next I have the off-white presto in the black colorway um, Yeah, I don't I don't think I made a video on this shoe right here But I actually grabbed this pair at a local sneaker shop over here in Philly And I actually got a pretty good price on these two And yeah, I have, I haven't worn them, but I actually seen recently. I've seen a picture of this shoe with purple laces and bro I need to find a pair of purple laces and put to put on these shoes right here because that black and purple fire but yeah um, off-white Prestos black colorway yeah in a collection alright so now on to the last two sneakers in my collection we got in it off with a bang. Um, so, first one, I have the Jordan 1 Off White UNC's. Now, this is one of those shoes that I actually managed to grab for retail last year. And unfortunately, I grabbed a size 8. I think I did a video on it. It was a size 8, it was too tight. I couldn't do it. I sold that pair and then eventually got my size, uh, size 9. And bro, this shoe is just beautiful. You know, Virgil definitely killed it this last year. And yeah, these are still DS. I haven't laced them up. Um, this is one of those pairs that I'm gonna keep on ice. I'm gonna let other people wear theirs first. And then, you know, just pull mine out. You know, looking all fresh, all crispy and clean. But yeah, off-white UNC's in a collection. Very, very good looking shoe. And then finally, last but not least, the last sneaker in the collection. Probably one of the craziest shoes that I have in my collection, I don't know, in my opinion, um, which is the Serena William Off-White uh, Air Max 97s. I did a trade to get these right here, and I don't know, it's just crazy that I have these in a collection like bruh I definitely wasn't gonna pay resale 
but I actually managed to, you know, talk a little bit, you know, do a little trade for a little bit of cash on top, and I actually managed to grab these for a deal, a steal, a deal. Serena Williams Air Max 97s, crazy, crazy shoe. I can't believe I have these shoes. It's just crazy. Serena William of Whites. Uh, I definitely want to get those blazers now since I have these, but I don't know. We'll see if I'll end up picking those up. But yeah, guys, that is going to be it for this video. I don't know how long this video is going to be, but if you guys watch the whole thing, you're a real one. Um, yeah. Those are all my sneakers in the collection right now. Yeah, very blessed to have all these sneakers. And yeah, man, cheers to another year full of dope sneakers. But yeah, let me know down in the comments below, what are you guys most excited for to drop this year? You know, we have the infrared sixes, we got those Travis Scott, um, Air, um, Jordan ones, I don't know why I keep saying Air Force, uh, Travis Scott, Jordan ones, we have the Red 11s that are apparently dropping this year. And we have just a whole bunch of other stuff dropping. A lot of crazy drops. But yeah, that is going to be it for this video. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more videos like this in the future. But yeah, I'm going to be streaming on Twitch now. So if you guys want to join the streams, link will be down in the uh, description down below. Um, and yeah, that is it. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.